Okay, so the question is how when people try to do, the, do their best and are following our directions to the letter, how come some people don't get up above 0.5? Uh, and there are a number of potential answers. The one that, when we've tried to look at this really carefully with real people in the real world, the most common thing is that they're so concerned about eating fat that they over they end up overeating protein. And that means um, maybe for a, a week or two, actually going back and weighing the protein sources and trying to stay within your ounces. Um, you know, that, that, that you and your coach have, have come to it in terms of uh, the goal. The other thing is we know that inflammation is an energy of, of, or is the enemy of ketone production. And sometimes it takes a while to get that inf those inflammation levels down. And this is frightening, but the fact that we guys and, and people carry internally in the abdomen, when it becomes inflamed, it's a fire that's very hard to put out. It takes a long time to quench that uh, um, uh, inflammation, the, the, the infiltrated white blood cells into adipose tissue. And so, uh, again, I can't say with authority that at any one, at any specific level of, of any of these inflammation biomarkers, you will just click into ketosis. But some, for many people, it takes quite a while to get through that initial kind of built up resistance that the body has, and some of which we associate with inflammation. 